Congress has been profiting off of war since 9-11. My fellow citizens, we will defend our freedom. We will bring freedom to others, and we will prevail. Since 2003, trillions of dollars have been poured into armed conflicts worldwide, with over 100,000 lives lost. But while members of Congress pay deference to the fallen in public and on TV, these wars are filling their pockets with millions of dollars. When military intervention in Afghanistan was approved by Congress, the stocks of five top defense companies rose over 900%. For the 47 members of Congress and their spouses who own stock in these companies, it was like hitting the jackpot. The conflict of interest here is clear. Vote yes on war, pad your bank account. And nearly two decades later, Congress is still winning big. Senator Roy Blunt, who sits on the Defense Appropriations Subcommittee, holds $250,000 in Lockheed Martin stock. Senator Sheldon Whitehouse owns $500,000 in stock from Raytheon, Honeywell, and Lockheed Martin. And even Representative Ro Khanna, who's been critical of defense spending, holds $165,000 in defense stocks with his spouse. It's a huge conflict of interest for Congress to own defense stocks when they decide if we go to war. War that has the power to shatter the lives of millions around the globe. Make them uphold their oath to the people. Join the movement to stop Congress from profiting off of war.